Hi guys, welcome back to another new video. In this video, we'll be showing you how you can build your own night lamp. But the interesting part is that the lampshade was designed by AI. It's going to be a pretty interesting build. So let's dive right into the video. We start by sketching a circle of diameter 100 mm and extruding it to a height of 10 mm. We then create a plane 160 mm above this circle and create the same kind of circle over there as well. We then create a mid plane between the two circles and sketch smaller circles around the bigger circles. Using the circular pattern feature, we make six smaller circles. We repeat the process to make the same six circles 20 millimeters below the plane as well. Now we extrude all these sketched circles to a height of 5 millimeter. Now that our base structure is ready, we choose the automated modeling tool of Autodesk Fusion to generate the lamp's design. This is an amazing tool that helped us make our lamp functional. There were various alternatives to choose from. Each of them were unique in their own ways. For our use case, however, we liked Alternative 4 a lot. We were thinking of having Alternative 5 as well, but then we finally decided to go with Alternative 4. Thanks to Fusion's automated modeling tool, this process was made much easier for us. Then we thickened this design to 2 millimeters. We then choose the top face to create the lid of this lamp using this spline feature. Now that it's done, we extrude this created lid to a height of 2 millimeters. With this, our lampshade is ready. We start by sketching a square of side 100 mm and then extruding it to a height of 42 mm. Then we construct a plane 2 mm below the top surface and use it to split the body in two parts. One will be the lid of this box and the other will be the base of the box in which the electronics are housed. On the lid we make a circle of 30 mm in the center and extrude it so that the rod around which the LEDs are wrapped around is made. Then we shell the second body. We make squares on all four corners to make space for the screws to go in. These screws will join the lid with the base. Thank you. 
We made slots for the Arduino and the light sensor. And then extruded it out to make holes for them. Now we sketch holes for the screws on the top face and then extrude those out to a distance of 12 millimeters, ensuring that it goes through the bottom body as well. This is how our base looks. Now we insert our lamp shade into this design. We align it with the base using the align feature. Now we want to create a hole for the wires to pass through. We select the base and make a 10 mm diameter hole on it, which we then extrude. With this, the hole is also ready. And here we have our lamp ready. I then uploaded my STL files to IAM Rapid and got an instant quote. I always trust IAM Rapid for all of my 3D printing needs as they are very quick and have a very less price compared to a lot of other brands out there. Plus they have an amazing clientele and a huge range of services like 3D printing, CNC machining and much more that you can go ahead to. The link to their website is in the description below. I received the printed part from IAM Rapid within two days and they had an amazing quality.
With this, our lamp is ready. Now, you can work peacefully at night, knowing that the other person in the room is not being disturbed by it. Thank you for watching our video. Hope to see you soon.